headed out of our main base camp and we're gonna be just setting up a, a small camp next to the lake today. I thought I need to try to fill the cooler with some fish before I leave, take them back and just let the family experience it. Especially some of these kokanee. We've had a bit of weather come in. Not really sure how that's gonna affect the fish, but uh, I've got my little spoon tied on from the other day and I've got flies and I've added a few more lures to the arsenal. My goal is to get 10 kokanee uh, and four trout. And we are going to put them on the proper grill. I've been cooking them on a little Coleman here, which isn't bad. Big green egg grill with a little OSG special touch sides. Oh, I do think so. Oh, yes. Got our first fish on. And it's a salmon. Oh, he's a runner. Oh my gosh, a jumper. Don't throw that hook, son. Don't throw that hook. On over here. We land you in the landing bay. That's a good one. Actually, that might be a rainbow, and it is. I've never seen one jump like that. First fish landed. One fish on. Okay, so I can get four trout, 10 kokanee. I really want those kokanee though. That was an awesome fight though, crazy. I'm hoping that they're kind of stacked on this point since the, the waves, the currents like really coming through here. Little map spoon. Oh, I've got a tiny. Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh, it's a it's a little rainbow. It's a little baby rainbow. Look at that little guy. See ya. I need your big brother. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's a good in there. Oh, yes. Get out of those weeds. Come here. I'll take you to my landing zone. My landing strip over here. little rainbow. Yes. Gosh, these things are like snakes. Just want to get away. Yeah, that's just something like a bass. You know, you grab a bass, you got them. Not with a trout. Never think twice. Okay. Two trout. Get two more of those. And we got a hammer on the kokanees. I've got a Mondo. Mondo on the spinner. Oh my gosh, look at this giant. He absolutely hammered it twice. Come here, buddy. Yeah. There we go. I switched lures and I got a hammer of a trout. Nice. Let me just unhook you. While you're there doing your thing. Okay. Wow, that is a nice trout. That is my biggest rainbow trout ever. Rainbow PB. Going in some aluminum foil and butter though. That's a sizable one there. Wow. I'm gonna say he's close to 18 inches. I've been throwing that spoon. I was like, I'd found an extra tackle box in my truck. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna just try some of these things in here that I would never throw for bass. And this is one of them. It's a, another MEPS. It's a MEPS, MEPS Comet number one. And uh, it's literally got like a plastic fish on the end. It's stupid looking, but it's on a inline spinner. And I uh, felt one bite it, slowed it down, give it a little twerk, and he absolutely slammed it and then jumped. 
I missed the jump with the GoPro. I'm trying to be conservative on batteries because it's been a, uh, well, I'm almost out. I'm at the last of my resources here in Colorado. Okay, I need one more trout. What a mondo, that's awesome. Next cast. This lure is fire right now. Little Meps, another good trout. It's gonna complete my trout game. Let's see if I can land this guy fully. I'm up in here in the shallows. We're jumping out there. Yes. Oh, no, don't get away. Oh my gosh, man, these things. It's like they know how to get away. Are you kidding me? Oh, they are not caught until they're on the stringer. I'm gonna tell you what. Oh, there we go. That's four really nice trout, one absolute tank. Now, I just need to get me some salmon. Oh my gosh, another one. Another one. Oh, this might be, this might be a, uh, yeah. No, it's a rainbow. I'm just slurping this little mess up. Already caught enough of your, your kind today. Back into the deeps, shallows, whatever. Another rainbow on the Metsy. Okay, buddy, I can't keep you, so. You can just get off now. Boy, they love this thing. At this stage in the game, I fulfilled my limit of trout. I've got a big one. Feel good about it. But, I want those kokanee, man. They're, they're better, in my opinion. Rainbow trout's good, but it's kokanee or better. And I'm going to uh, switch up lures, maybe. I'm going to change locations and lures and try to get these. Ooh, I wonder what that is. Hmm. Creatures of the woods. I'm going to uh, try to get 10 of those. I may need to get a spoon on, go deep. It's overcast. Like, I don't know. I don't know these things about these fish, but I got a little tackle box full of stuff to try. And uh, we're gonna give it a whirl. Try to fill this bag up. We got something. Could be a rainbow. Oh, oh yeah, it's a kokanee. It's a kokanee. Got him on the spoon. Kind of look like rainbows. They got they got a sharper tail. You can tell when you get him in. If I can get him in, come here. These are so delicious. Delicious. Baby. Oh, no, 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 no. Nope, get up here. Yes. Caught. Oh, that's a good sign. I got them on the spoon. Hook just came right out. This bag here, sir. Might be the first ever fish inside of a money bag. Okay, either the kokanees are not running through here or my spoon just isn't working. I'm gonna go back to old trusty. This guy has a little orange on it. Seemed to get the job done the other day. So far, I'm one kokanee into the kokanee portion of this challenge. Good kokanee. Good kokanee on little spoon. God, they fight so hard. No, are you a rainbow? Dang, I'm bruiser too. Came off. That's fine. New species acquired. That is a brown trout i believe beautiful but not sizable really cool though so many different species of fish in this lake 
great lake to bank fish. Jeez. Come on, baby. Big it out on the point. Just taking it easy. Light pressure. Be a kokanee. Let me land you. I think you're a kokanee. Yep. Yep, you are. You definitely are. And he sees me and he's freaking out. This is when they get away. Right here close to the bank. Stay underwater. Get up here. Yeah. yeah. Two kokanee. I believe that is a male right there. He's starting to get that pronounced nose. That same spot. Come on. Need eight more. It's all the way up there. I think I've got me another brown. How now, brown? Oh, yeah. That's a sizable brown. Uh, cool fish. Beautiful. Oh, easy. Put you back in the water, let you calm down. Wood sucker's got some teeth too. You're free. Dang. I did not get those jumps on camera, but that was the jumpiest trout I've ever caught. He was going sky high. Got him, got him. Be a kokanee, you're small, whatever you are. You are the rainbow. Boy, that's three species, three cast. That's nuts. Oh, got him. Oh, come on. Oh, kokanee. Look at those jumps, man. Crazy. Take it easy. No, 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 no. Oh, are you a brown? No. Oh, you're a rainbow. Rainbow just getting it in the air. Wow. Taste the rainbow. Feel the rainbow. Just trying my fly game here for a second. Just for funsies. I see some topwater activity. Oh, got him. Oh, whoa. Holy moly. Kidding me? Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Wow. That is awesome and worth breaking out the fly rod for that top water baby rainbow wow buddy did you eat it how amazing man too bad too bad i can't keep one of you guys well the bite has slowed way down i have moved around a little bit and trying to catch more kokanees all I can get is these trout. I mean, gosh dang, they're delicious, but I can only keep four. So I think what I'm gonna do is set up camp here. Well, I'm gonna just park my truck here in this area. I'm just gonna walk along. And when that sun starts going down, I better build me a fire. It's gonna be cold. This is where we're gonna take off from in the morning, head back home. And then we are gonna cook these trout up. Of course, I gotta clean them down by the water. But hopefully we can fulfill the rest of these kokanee. Either way, I have six fish to take home to the family. Got me another kokanee. Yes. Okay, that is it. I gotta shut down the fishing part of it because uh, I still haven't made my tent. This is my last night here. 
up in Colorado. And I'm getting up early. I'm going to drive all the way back down. I will see you back at the treehouse, and we are going to see what Stephanie thinks about rainbow trout versus kokanee. They're both good. There's not a losing situation. Sound of that airplane. That means we're back in civilization, y'all. I made it home safely. Thank goodness. Home from the mountains. And I've got the grill going. I thought it'd be interesting to see OSG's take on the uh, trout versus the kokanees. I think the kokanees are a clear winner, but we're gonna give her a blind taste test and just kind of see what she thinks. Really want to get her up there. I've already showed her some some pictures and a little bit of video from my trip and she says she's all about it. I don't know if she can really handle it. I mean there's like nothing around. Let me know in the comments if you want to see me and OSG and maybe baby Emmy go up there all together on a little camping trip. Not more pants covered I told you I got some fish. What do you think about that? Uh. Oh gosh, it still has its head. What I found really interesting is, you know, people think trout are amazing. They love the trout. I thought trout were good, but I thought kokanee salmon were really good. Kokanee salmon? Kokanee salmon, yes. Have you ever had one of those? I don't think I have. Probably not. Is that That's what, you want? what she wants. You just wanted to hang out with daddy. Let's do a blind taste test. Okay. I'm going to show you the easiest fish to clean in the world. You too, honey. Oh, me too? Yes. So if I had to clean one fish for like the rest of my life, every day. It'd be trout? It'd be the trout. We're gonna do a full lake life debriefing of my trip over there. Link down below, go check us out over there. So, honey, this is a trout. Ooh, this is a brown so trout right here. Okay, um, let me just pump this up a hair. So, to clean a trout, everybody paying attention? Emmy, go up in the butt. Ooh. Go up to the throat. Okay, cut it right behind the spine. Take your finger, pull at the same time. Smash the guts out. Rinse with water. That's a clean trout. Oh. Wabam. So I've got rainbows and kokanees in this bag and I've kind of got a mix. I've got one cutthroat in here so I did pretty good on the fishing side of things. Maybe elk. You know the elk was going to be like food for a year but I got food for a week That's or good. two at least. You are doing grits I'm to doing go along with these. Grits. Oh my gosh all I ate was taters this week as a side so I'm ready to have some delicious OSG-ness in my life and uh Let's get that grill popping. Let's get these babies in some aluminum foil in the kitchen. With OSG. Gosh darn, so many people call me today. <laughs> Can't even get to your grits. Ah! See, I didn't have to deal with this in nature. The grits, are you ready? I'm ready. Roasted some poblano with some garlic, and I did like a pepper jack cheese. You missed the unveiling. Oh, so <laughs> my it's, grits. It's Emmy always. She's like, Hold me, Daddy. Hold me. I miss you. Anyways. Oh my gosh. See, this is what I needed. Ooh. This, I think. I think we need to go camping together and team I up. So. Like, do some skillet meals. Yeah. I provide. Mm. You decide Ooh, what's like going that. on the side. I would I, love to like, like prep some meals, pack them in the cooler, and then just around a campfire, desserts. Oh. <laughs> you can even come too, sweet pea. She might get all the rocks and eat them. <laughs> oh gosh, there's a bug on the carpet. Ah! Don't worry. We got it. I, I smashed it. I didn't even hesitate. 
Just locked in and grabbed it. And we didn't even know. So weird, it's just started raining slightly. It's just like I'm back in Colorado. OSG is not gonna know which one is which. They're already wrapped up in tinfoil. I know which ones are which. We have a rainbow trout, we have a cutthroat trout, and then we also have the kokanee trout. Or, they're not a trout, they're a salmon. I never even tried the cutthroat, so I'm gonna try that for myself and see what that tastes like. By the way, if you wanna check out some of the new merch at guggensquad.com, including some of the stuff from my boy. A link down below for uh, all the new merch. Limited time only for these guys, so check them out while you can. That timer means we are done. Always burp your egg before you go in big time. Oh yeah. Y'all see there is a, like a browning on the top of the tin foil here. And that is key. It's cooking for both sides. Oh yeah. Time to get a platter and bone appetite. Literally, the bones. <laughs> oh yeah, these are cooked just right. Mm -hmm. So, just don't burn get me. yourself some of this right there. Mm. What do you got on that? I can taste the butter and the lemon. You want her daughter's running away. <laughs> um, Texture. Texture, How do you it's, feel? it's light. It's Quit looking. I kind of taste like a little bit like a lobster. Lobster? Well, but lobster's not pretty damn good. White. Hey. Emmy. Okay, we got your pot. All right. <laughs> okay, daddy's getting a taste of what I've been dealing with for the past week. Get you some of that. I'm gonna taste a little lighter. Tastes a little lighter? Yeah, like the okay. other one was a little bit thicker. Did you get any bones in either bite of those? No. Okay, no bones. I mean, I'm not giving you any skins on any of these, by the way. Yeah, I know. That's, that's the best part. Okay. Eyes closed. Mm -hmm. Ready. Oh, that's a big bite. <laughs> Last one right there. Mm. What do you got on that guy? Mm. Gosh, they're all so close. I think I like that one the best. Whoa, okay. And honestly, I could not, I am a salmon girl. I love salmon. I couldn't tell which one was the salmon. Really? Was that one salmon? No. No? So you chose the rainbow trout. The first one was a cutthroat trout. The second one was the kokanee salmon. Whoa. Which, I'll let you have a bite of the kokanee. That was actually the one that I would have gone with the least. I would have done the last one. Are you serious? Try and it. then the first one. Try another bite of the kokanee. Okay. That's got a little skin on it too. So you can get some of that salmon feel. Oh, you know how salmon is but like- But you don't like it as much. It's the trout. Mm -mm. Daggum! I never thought I would have been a trout girl. That is good. Wow, that cutthroat's pretty good too. That's good. Okay, y'all, it is time. Now we are all back with the family now. It is time to put our awesome, beautiful, adventurous daughter to bed. She's getting a little crazy out here. She's just exploring a little too much, just like your dad. <laughs> Gets her adventurous spirit she from can't her dad. Sit still. And we're gonna go enjoy these trout and salmon with some grits. Again, let us know in the comments if you'd like to see us all go camping together and do a full-blown family experience in the great outdoors. Thank you guys for being here. Thank you for being here for the whole entire series up in the mountains of the great state of Colorado. And I will see you on the next adventure. Amy, come back here. Dad, yeah. See you guys later.